Rob Hogan with the Boxing Boys. I'm delighted to be with Harvey Horn. You still horny? Still horny, yeah. I heard a good few people laughing when the, when the music came out, didn't it? I told them to change it. I had Return of the Mac come, to come out. But um, yeah, no, I was, I, um, still it's my, it's my soundtrack. I mean, I think anyone who doesn't remember the 90s, they probably won't get the reference. Okay, yeah. So you might get away with it. Yeah, you, uh, you, you've been in there. Um, right hook in particular. Looked, yeah, what the body, yeah, it's lovely in the body. I mean, it's so small, it goes up. But it's an actual fly weight. And this is what I mean, when they're actually flies, I'm very big for the weight. I am big for the weight. Um, a lot of the time over my career, I mean, by the time I won the belt at Flyway, at W Go European form, I've never boxed anyone at Flyway. And I think it showed there that as a natural flyway, I'm, I'm a big lump, I'm a big lump. And so, um, yeah, it was good. I was just too big for it, too big, too sharp. Yeah, but I thought box well. Box well. A lot of positives to draw out of it. Also, a lot of stuff to improve on, but it is what it is. Absolutely. So, yeah, this is just your sort of comeback. Uh, feel your way back in. Uh, when we spoke, yes, uh, was it two days ago? You, you really want the British title. Um, you want to go into a ten round the next if you can? I would like to go into a ten round the next. I'd like to do a ten round. I mean, there's plenty of belts around that uh, bacon or so like people have got some that like fly, maybe even super fly. There's a couple of belts there, but I want that British. I, I think I need a ten round. I think I do need a ten round for me to sit here. I'm confident jumping in for a twelve now, but. I know what is best for me, what I've learned from the last one. Just do a 10 round, do a 10 round, I'll take time, do a 10 round, I'll pick up another belt, and then worry about the 12. And you've already beaten each other. Yeah, I've beaten anyway. Yeah. So. Yeah, I boxed lucky against him, funny enough. Uh, that's my first 10 round. Up. But he's been doing a while, I think, isn't he? Yeah, that, mate, he's been getting. He, he beat, and he got a draw off of a kid that I know really well, Casey Kemi. I know him quite well. I've done a lot of rounds with him, he's no man. He's no man, he's a good fighter. Mm -hmm. So I was very surprised when I'm at No disrespect, I was just quite surprised stylistically, I thought Casey would have done it. But yeah, so I mean, so if you was looking at domestically, but I'll be honest, I'd rather stick a flyer. I would rather, if I have to go to a I'm going to have to, but I would rather stick a flyer and, and but not give away my like, reach power. Like. You want to have send a message out to Tommy Frank? <laughs> <laughs> Where's that wooden spoon? You know, you know. <laughs> No, do you know what it is? I, I, I've said this before in interviews. He seems like a right nice geezer, doesn't he? Like, I've never met him, never met him. He seems like a right nice geezer. Um, but he's got the belt, he's got the belt. It's, it's what it is, it's business, isn't it? I'm not going to sit here and talk a lot of shit about him because he's, he, he's the one with the belt. If he, if he wants to give me that opportunity, I'm, I'm more than ready. He knows I'm, he knows I'm ready. I've, I've been quite vocal about it before. But we've both got losses now, both domestic, both got decent followings as well. So. Make sure we're getting, we're getting London. We're getting London. Tell him to come down London. London or Essex? Yeah, yeah or Essex. Yeah, yeah. fuck that. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I don't know. What's the better night out, Essex or oh, Sheffield? Oh, mate, but Essex, mate, London, London all day long. Have you been on a night out in Sheffield? I yeah. have. Oh, you, it's, I, I did enjoy it. No way. You must have been having now. <laughs> <laughs> no one enjoys a night out in Sheffield. I lived in Sheffield for three years. Oh, really? And I had to for GB. Okay. About three and a half years, I was up in that town. I did not like it. I did not like it. I mean, I like I like the people. The people are great. They're like the Yorkshire, the Yorkshire, they're great. But as a place, like, yeah, maybe I'm not glad. I mean, a lot of them came like, came on Instagram. Like, oh. All right, yeah. all right. There's a long queue of people waiting to speak to you, Harvey. Uh, great to see you back, and yeah, we look forward to uh, you on Channel Five. Hopefully, for some titles next time. Brilliant. No, thank you very much for the time. Mate. Thanks, Harvey. Yo, if you enjoyed the video, feel free to hit the like, subscribe, and share. As always, if you want to support us to the next level, head over to the patreon.com backslash the boxing voice. We have tons of exclusive from Border Wars and Title betting shows. The list goes on and on and on. But in addition to that, if you guys have questions for fighters, trainers, or promoters, this is where you can submit them. We will run out, get these questions answered, and put it back on the show just for you guys. Appreciate it. Peace.